So these are wetlands, huh? Pretty accurate. It is a bog. The smell is making my eyes burn. You know what is a fair bit more potent than when I last visited, now that you mention it. Tyr was a friend to the Giants. I wonder if he and Mom ever met. If he was a part of the rebellion here. It's certainly possible. The God of War often advocated for the Giants. Although I don't recall if he ever declared allegiance outright. Come on. There's gotta be a faster way to get down there. done. Okay. There's got to be some way to turn the wheel up here. Go <laughs> <laughs> there! Give a man some warning if he's about to suddenly end up snout deep in cheek. The ground. Is that an earthquake? Hmm. An occasional but not unheard of happenstance in Spartalfheim. With all the mining here, the land's bound to be a wee bit bothered. Think you can reach the wheel from here? Job getting it to lower exactly where we need it. I was thinking, because it's so warm, maybe it's not as you can see. The effects here appear far more gaseous in nature. Observe the geysers, observe the aforementioned aroma. These effects were present before in some form, but now there's new extremity to them. They capped those geysers. <laughs> hmm. I think we need to get that wheel moving, but the water doesn't reach.
moving and the gate's coming down. That's dwarven ingenuity for you. Back to the boat. <clears throat> if the dwarves of this realm are anything like Brock and Sindri, it's hard to imagine them siding with Odin. Well, all too often people are blinded to all but their immediate self-interest. Odin offered them safety, and defying him can be quite dangerous. Fast. How shall we catch it? Flank it. Attack from behind. Good. Father, up there. there. There's got to be another chain to lower the rest of the gate. I get it. If you freeze the guys, the pressure will turn the wheel. Holding the block. <laughs> nice one. That's one of Cavassier's poems. Very highbrow. You should collect any others you find. Exactly, are you hoping to learn from Tia? Well, like I said, I was hoping he could tell me something about Loki. I'd also like to hear some of his stories. Traveling to other lands, giant stuff, and 
Maybe about what it was like to fight back in the day. Just for the history, obviously. History? <laughs> Let's hope Tyr's in a talkative mood after being in prison for so long. Not all of Odin's captives can be as charmingly voluble as myself. We have no proof Tyr is truly here. Right. 